Hi everyone and welcome to Positively Kimmy. I am Kimmy. If you are new here, welcome. This is a safe space. And if you are one of my returning subscribers and my besties, hi guys, how are you? I hope you are all having a great day or night, wherever it is you might be watching this. I decided there are so many products from Timu that I have gotten that I use on a daily basis and I wanted just to show you what they are and why they are my favorites. So the first thing I'm going to start off with is the hair. Now if you notice, like I have flyaways all over the place. I had gotten this SNTE hair wax stick. I had seen Laura Lee use it on one of her videos and it was $6 at Amazon. Well, this is $2 for the same product. You just push it from the bottom and push it up. And wherever you have flyaways, mine are always back here. And right up here, you just put it on. It flattens them and takes away the flyaway look. And all of a sudden, you're left with silky smooth hair. It's also great, and then you just push it back down. It's also great if you're wearing a ponytail and you want it very slick. This is the product that you would go for for that. Um, and I love it. The way I keep my hair looking shiny most times is they have this Moroccan oil, and it's called by R Top R and it's Moroccan hair oil. You put a few squirts in your hand. I'm just gonna put one because I already have some. You rub it in your hand and you just go like this. And all of a sudden, your dry, damaged hair looks healthy, really healthy. And you don't need to do a lot to it. You don't need a lot of product. The only thing with this is it has a really bad scent. Um, but for the price, I can handle the bad scent temporarily while this is in my hair. But once it's in my hair, it's fine. And I just love the way it comes out so much that... I don't mind the scent. So that's the Moroccan oil. I believe it was like $2.48. The next thing I have is my, it looks, <laughs> the name's not on it anymore. It was Shishido um, 4X Mascara. And when I tell you this mascara will change your life because it is so mind blowing on how well it coats your lashes, it volumizes your lashes. It, it does everything that you want a mascara to do and more. I mean, it just is absolutely beautiful. Let me put a little bit more in there. It's absolutely beautiful and there's not a lot I can say about it other than it's on the thinner side. So be careful when you put it on, try not to sneeze. Um, if you get it on, you could always take it off with a Q-tip but it just shows up, shows out, and is absolutely stunning, and it is buildable, and you can see it is amazing. The lashes I'm wearing are also from Timu. I bought a whole bunch, so I don't know exactly what style this is, and the nails I have on right now are the ones I showed you in a video yesterday that I thought were a little too springy, but I like them, so I don't mind a neutral nail. Now, the next thing I have is I lost the top to it. It's called Follicure Face Contour. I use this constantly. I get it in a very dark shade because I like a darker shade. I put it up higher than I normally would put a contour. And then I would blend it in with a, um, a brush. But it gives you the nicest lifted cheekbones and if you want to contour your whole face, it's perfect. Right now I have some bronzer on and I have a little bit of darker blush, but I just absolutely love the way it looks and how uplifted my cheeks are after that. Now I'm not wearing lip liner because I don't have a lip liner that I think is phenomenal that I've gotten from there. I don't think I've gotten any lip liner from there, but I did get the Langmani Matte Velvet Lipsticks. And I love, love, love these. So it comes in two, four, six shades. I only have five because one is in my purse. <laughs> and these are basically them. They're nudes, they're pink nudes, brown nudes, mauve nudes, and nude nude. I'm going to try, and I'm gonna put this one on, which is matte lip. It's L104. It doesn't have a shade other than L104. I'm going to need a mirror to do this. 
and again my lips are not lined this is what it looks like and it doesn't give you that dry matte feeling I mean look how gorgeous that is Put a little bit on like that And I think it's absolutely beautiful. All the shades are absolutely gorgeous. With a lip liner, it would have come out a little bit better probably. But I don't think it came out bad. And this is, so far, most of my go-to products that I use every single day without fail from Timu because I just think they're awesome. So let me know if you've picked any of them up. Again, we have the... Langmani matte velvet very comfortable I don't like anything drying on my lips I'm at an age where if you're gonna dry me out we can't use you this also is absolutely amazing it's follow cure follow cure face I use it as contour stick you could use it as bronzer as well I have the 4xl mascara it is amazing. I have long lashes to begin with, so you don't notice product on me sometimes, but this is absolutely amazing. I do have the Moroccan hair oil. I use it every day. You can see I'm gonna need another one soon. I don't like the scent of that one, but I can get over it because look how healthy my hair looks. I mean, and it's not greasy looking, so that's a win for me. And the last thing that is part of my staple is the SNTE hair wax stick. And you use it for any flyaways, you can use it for baby hairs, whatever it is that you need it for. And it's gonna keep all that stuff down and just be amazing. So I hope you enjoyed this video of my favorite Timu, uh, Timu essentials, makeup essentials that I use on a daily basis. In the meantime, be happy, be healthy, be safe, be blessed, and most of all, be positively you because there's nobody else quite like you and that makes me so incredibly happy. Thank you so much for spending some time with me. Bye, guys.